Hello there Aries, thank you for stopping by for your tarot video forecast for the week of August 3rd through the 9th. I am using my Russian tarot of St. Petersburg once again. And what we have coming up on Monday is we have the Emperor showing up. So this is telling me that on Monday you are going to be having some kind of interaction with a boss, a supervisor, or you are going to be going to a job interview or something along those lines. But this is an interaction you're having with somebody who is in charge. For most of you, it does feel like it's work-related, although there's a few of you out there, maybe 10, 15, 20%, that this could be family-related. So this could be an interaction with a father or a grandfather or an uncle, um, something like that. But this is gonna be a male authority figure in most cases. For a few of you, this is gonna be a female authority figure, and this is gonna be a very strong personality female, if, for those of you who are interacting with the female. So, um, I just feel like, like I said, for most of you, this is work-related, um, supervisor or boss. And for those of you who are not working, for a lot of you, now we're talking about somebody that you're interviewing with on Monday, okay? So, moving on to Tuesday. Tuesday we have a three of coins in reverse. Three of coins in reverse. I feel like for you Aries, that just means that you're going to be doing some mundane things Tuesday. Some things that you could do kind of on autopilot. Some of those tedious types of things like, you know, I don't know, maybe vacuuming or doing the dishes, things that people don't really enjoy doing, but you can do them on autopilot, you can do them without thinking about them. And I feel like for a lot of you, this is going to be tasks at work too. Uh, maybe, you know, reorganizing the filing system or something like that. Maybe you're going to be filing. Actually, reorganizing would be more thought than this card indicates. So probably more like just doing mundane things like filing, things like that. Just um, stuff you could do in your sleep. That's basically what I see coming up for you on Tuesday, Aries. And then on Wednesday, what we have coming up is the Chariot in Reverse. And what I'm... Okay, so let me tell you about the Chariot right side up. Because what I'm hearing is that almost, like, close call, almost got it, but not quite. So, the Chariot up, right side up just talks about that you have... Um, a situation in your life that you have been dreaming about making real. You've been dreaming about making it into reality. Not only have you been dreaming about it, but you've been taking some action to do that. Um, this is the type of situation that um, this requires some self-discipline on your part, probably also some coordination with some other people to accomplish this. And so whatever this is that you've been trying to accomplish, that you've had to use your own self-discipline and you've had to coordinate with other people, this almost happens on Wednesday. And I keep hearing the words, close call, close call. So I think, you know, you were just so close to having whatever this is happening that it's just... Like when you realize that it didn't happen, it's almost going to be like a surprise. Um, I don't feel like this is the last hurrah on your efforts. I do feel like this is something that you will be generating or manifesting in your life here very shortly. It's just that just not quite yet on Wednesday. Still coming in, just not exactly quite on Wednesday, even though looks like it will right up to the last minute. Now, Thursday, what we have coming up is we have the hanged man for you Aries and what this is telling me is that on Thursday you are going to be um, dealing with a situation that you don't really know how to deal with it and so what you're doing is you're going to stay kind of paralyzed in that situation not taking any action until you have a chance to figure out what you really want to do so this may be a day when you actually choose to meditate or get some quiet time but definitely a day that you're putting some thought in on whatever this situation is that's kind of holding you in place all right, so on Friday, Knight of Coins for you, Aries. Knight of Coins, I've had this card come up literally as people were paying their bills. <laughs> but this really talks about one of two things. This says, Aries, that on Friday you're either going to be doing what you can to make your budget stretch as far as you want it to stretch, or you're going to be very diligent about bringing income in on Friday. So for those of you that you have a job, you're going to be diligent about showing up on time and doing a good job and impressing the bosses, that type of thing. For those of you who have your own company, you're going to be very diligent about following through on projects that can um, generate income for you. Okay. So that's what we have coming up on Friday, diligence with income or with the budget, 
for some of you actually both. Saturday, The Magician in Reverse. This is interesting. I feel like a lot of you Aries on Saturday are actually going to go to a carnival and you're going to see uh, some tricksters, some illusionists <laughs> on Saturday. Some kind of carnival or festival, could be a street fair, um, but I do feel like you're going to be watching some tricksters in action, professional tricksters. Not like um, con man type people, but just like this part of the show to create these illusions. So I feel like for a lot of you, that's actually what we're talking about is some kind of festivity where you would see tricksters on Saturday for you Aries. I was just feeling to see if there's anything that anybody else needs to be aware of, like if some of you really have somebody that's trying to pull something over on you on Saturday. I don't get a really strong sense that that's what's going on. This card really is indicating more of a fun type of trickster around you on Saturday. Now, Sunday, what you have coming up, Aries, is the Ace of Swords. The Ace of Swords is telling me that you have this great thought, this great aha moment on Sunday. And this aha moment is one of um, realizing the truth of something. That's what I'm really hearing, that there's a situation that you haven't really faced the whole truth on. You've sort of been in denial about what the situation is really all about and, and how all the pieces fit together in this situation. And I feel like on Sunday, all of a sudden, everything's going to click and you're going to get it. You're really going to understand, oh... That's what this situation is about. You're going to come out of that denial and start looking at that um, through the eyes of somebody who's looking at the cold hard facts and not somebody who's looking through those rose colored glasses of, oh yeah, but, you know, and making excuses for people and blah, blah, blah. Okay, so um, a new enlightenment really coming in on Sunday for you, Aries. Now that is your week. For those of you who would like to schedule a private session with me, please check out my website. Find the service that works best for you. I'm at amista.info, A-M-I-S-T-A dot I-N-F-O. Right now, my wait list is not that long. So, if you want to get in for a quick reading, this is a good time to do that. I can probably um, help you out either the day that you contact me or the next day. Okay, so Aries, that's your week. Thank you everyone for stopping by, for liking, for sharing, for subscribing. I appreciate all of your support so much. Everyone have a fantastic week. I'll see you back here next week. Peace out.